welcome back to my channel. It's Sierra, and I'm here with some summer hygiene essentials. All of these products are gonna have you smelling amazing all day. You won't have to worry about being musty. I cannot let the girls go musty this summer, okay? Before I hop into this video, I just wanna let y'all know that I made it to the Sephora Squad finalist. This is the last stretch, you guys. So if you love my content, if I've ever influenced you to buy anything at all, please leave me a testimonial. I would be so, so grateful, and I'll leave it linked down below. Anyways, let's just hop in. So it literally all starts in the shower. There's no point in even putting on perfume if you're going into it musty like here are some products to incorporate into your shower routine for the warm weather let's go when it's hotter outside i always like to start off with a good bar soap i like the dove white bar or the dove sensitive bar you can use this all over your body even in like your more intimate areas it's fragrance free hypoallergenic this is kind of like a base clean it just helps to get off all that dirt and grime for the day and any odor causing bacteria because that's what's going to make you musty at the end of the day these are pretty inexpensive you can get a four pack of these for under ten dollars I always have a bunch of these on deck, especially the sensitive ones. If you struggle with body odor and you don't know how to get rid of it, try starting off with the bar soap and report back to me. Y'all have already seen this body wash a million times on TikTok. I didn't know if it was actually good because a lot of the videos seem like very sponsored-ish, but I decided to try it for myself and I'm actually obsessed. I smell so good after using this. I smell good for a long time. It's the Salt Air Body Wash. There are a couple of scents that I really love, but this one has to be my favorite. It's so summery. I put so many people onto this. They send me pics of their shower and they're like, you deserve a Grammy for this. This is the Exotic Pulp Scent. It's a very citrusy passion fruit. It smells like orange peels, passion fruit. It just smells like the summertime. It's so good. This is almost out. I need to restock. This is my absolute favorite. And this is also a skin brightening serum body wash. If you have hyperpigmentation, you might have like dark underarms, dark inner thighs. This helps to brighten that. And the fact that this is a serum body wash is a huge plus my skin looks and feels so delicious almost like i use lotion already so nourishing my skin feels so silky body wash the smell lasts for so long and i feel like this one is just the epitome of the summertime so if you're a target and you see this one the orange one add it to cart my favorite in shower exfoliants are the tree hut scrubs right now i'm liking the vanilla i just picked this one up you really can't go wrong with any scent i'm just a huge vanilla girl i also really like the peach sorbet one that's the one that I've been using with the exotic pulp body wash that I just showed you. This is also a great step to use before shaving just to make sure you don't get any ingrown hairs. This buffs away all that dry, dull, dead skin and you're going to be looking like a beach goddess. Skin is going to be nice and supple. This also has shea butter in it so it helps to moisturize while it exfoliates. These Tree Hut Sugar Scrubs are my favorite scrubs. They're really coarse. They have really thick granules. Another really good scent for the summer is the Tropic Glow. That scrub smells so similar to the Sol de Janeiro Bombo cream so if you are a fan of the bum bum cream you're gonna have to pick that one up it's at ulta and target but like i said you really can't go wrong with any of them here's the most important part a good deodorant i used to use degree and dove and i mean those are cute but recently i tried some new ones and i'm never going back the donna karen cashmere mist deodorant this is a little bit pricey it's 32 dollars but this smells absolutely insane it's like a powdery floral vanilla there's lily of the valley i think there's sandalwood it's almost baby powdery but it's sweet i got this at sephora during the sephora sale and i'm literally obsessed i recently went in to hug somebody and she was like you smell really good what perfume is that i wasn't wearing perfume that's the gag i wasn't wearing perfume it was literally just this deodorant there is a cashmere mist perfume so if you wanted to layer you could try that out but i just wear the deodorant and put on whatever else i want this is a deodorant and an antiperspirant so it's going to keep you smelling fresh it's also going to fight against any sweat so if you have a hard time with like sweat stains under the arms forget about it literally you will never stink or sweat again with this like Oh my god, why didn't I try this sooner? If there's one thing you get out of this whole video, it needs to be this deodorant. I talked about this product in a recent video. I wasn't really sure about how I felt about it at first, but after using this for a few weeks, I really love it. And I think this one is a staple for the summer. This is the Lumi Whole Body Deodorant. Now, I know y'all have seen these ads all over YouTube, like the pre-rolls for the Lumi deodorant. I didn't ever think I would try it, but I saw it at Target and I was like, okay, well, since it's in my face, I mean, I have to get it. This is the Clean Tangerine scent. This also, you'll never stink again, like, ever. This is the Invisible Cream version, so you kind of just put some on your finger and put it wherever you need. I also have the solid version, but I keep that in my little emergency kits in the car. This is an aluminum-free deodorant. You use it on pits, privates, and beyond. I have thick thighs. My thighs rub together all the time, and I get that annoying thigh sweat. And I've been using this every day for the past few weeks, and it's over with. Like, I can go to the gym, do a little workout, and 
normally after the gym, y'all, I smell like I went to the gym. But when I use this, I don't smell like anything. The Clean Tangerine is my favorite scent. There are other scents. I believe there's like a peony. I didn't like that one too much. There's a toasted coconut. And like I said, summer staple through and through. I talked about an in-shower exfoliant. Here's an out-of-the-shower exfoliant. It's slathered. You can see just how much I have used of this. This is an exfoliating body serum for textured skin. If you have strawberry skin or just rough and bumpy skin, like I used to have some bumpy parts on my elbows. This is going to get rid of that completely. There's retinol, lactic acid, urea. It helps you brighten the skin and smooth the skin. Also, if you have any scars, let's say like bug bite scars, childhood scars, I've noticed that this is helping to lighten those. I use this about three times a week after I get out of the shower. I dry off a little bit, put this on, and then I put a lotion on top. But it really does help to smooth out any imperfections on your skin. Give you that nice, even tone for the summer. Also, this is really good to use after shaving. Once again, if you have strawberry skin or anything like that and you don't know what to use, I definitely recommend checking this one out. This is my favorite affordable body lotion. This is the EOS 24 Hour Moisture Coconut Waters Body Lotion. This has seven nourishing oils and butters, and this so into your skin immediately. This performs like a high-end moisturizer, but it's literally only $8. There's creamy coconut, hibiscus, and musk, and it just smells like an island girl. It's such a tropical, fresh smell. It literally just soaks right in. Like there's no having to rub over and over and over. What this smells like is being on the beach in a skimpy little bikini, wearing a sarong, drinking a pina colada. Don't buy this if you don't want people to compliment you. Oils. Oils are going to be your best friend for the summer. I'm gonna look slick. One is the Osea Algae Body Oil. This has a soft citrusy scent to it, and as you can tell, I really love this. I use this every single night. It's my favorite thing to use after a shower. Put it on damp skin, and I feel like using it on damp skin is what's gonna have you looking the best. This has antioxidants and minerals that nourish the skin. It's seaweed infused, it's not greasy, and there's also a little bit of an aromatherapy aspect to this. This one is really rich, but it doesn't feel heavy or greasy, but it still gives you that slick look. Using this oil is gonna make you feel like you just had a spa treatment. The smell is so relaxing and the way your skin feels and looks after this is unmatched. There's a body butter version of this, but I honestly don't recommend that. The oil is the best thing. For the daytime, I really love the Kopari Sun Shield Body Glow. This has SPF 50, always opt for an SPF during the day. And as you can see, there's also gold shimmer in this. It has this light coconut and hibiscus scent, so it's like a tropical floral. This is what I put on to go to the pool party. This is gonna have you looking and smelling like that girl. I put on too much of this and it did feel really heavy So you kind of have to watch how much you're putting on but I still really love this It comes in this rose gold finish, but I just prefer the gold. I feel like it just looks more Summertime if you're looking for a cute little summer smell. I really like these new Sol de Janeiro scents This one is called when in Rio and the other one is bikini season bikini season is this juicy guava with coconut water pink musk This is my favorite actually it's very fruity, and I think this one also lasts the longest out of the new collection. I really like these to just throw in my bag if I'm gonna touch up on my scent. These are just the perfect little thing for on the go. When in Rio is also really cute too. It has jasmine, vanilla, amber, pear, and sandalwood. I like to use this one in my hair. I'm not sure if this is one of their hair and body mists, but I mean, I still use it in my braids, whatever. These are so fun for the summer, and they're also really affordable. But for actual perfumes, I have two right here that I think scream summertime. First is Lust for Sun by Julia S. Gunn. This is not like their other scents at all. This one smells like a perfume. It's not like their typical skin scent vibe. This has creamy coconut, manoy, vanilla, gardenia. It smells like you're walking through a tropical garden. This is not a coconut forward perfume. More of a white floral, but the coconut is still there. This perfume paired with the Sol de Janeiro Bum Bum Cream. This perfume also lasts a really long time. And even in the heat, this gives me an all day wear time. It smells coconutty. It smells coconutty and solar, but without that sunscreen note that people like to make their coconut perfume smell like. If you like Tom Ford Soleil Blanc or Mugler Alien Goddess Intense, I'd like this to be one that you also really enjoy. This is a good one if you want to like get into niche perfumes. This was actually my first niche perfume. It doesn't have that DNA that most of them have. This is a ripe juicy soft mango oh my god wow that just made my mouth water the notes are ripe mango pink sugar blackberry lotus and there's also a red wine note this one is like a sultry seductive 
flirty mango. It's mouthwatering, it's juicy. Both of these are from Twisted Lily and you can sample them. I'll leave it down below and you can also use my code Sierra 10 for extra money off. Okay, so that wraps up this video, y'all. I hope y'all enjoyed. I hope y'all found something to add into your summer routine. All of those products have me smelling super fresh all day. Once again, if you love my content, please make sure to leave me a testimonial for the Sephora squad down below. Thanks so much for watching and I'll see y'all in my next video. Bye.